Hello friends, what's up? Ashish here from Guiding Tech and today we would be comparing the Lao One S and the Lenovo Vibe K4 Note, the top two contenders of the budget smartphone category in India at the moment and see a side-by-side -side speed and performance comparison along with the memory management test. So let's get started and have a look. So friends, the very first thing that we'll do is run up the benchmarks and just to make sure that there are no running uh, background apps running in the background, let me just go ahead and fire up the NT2. Now uh, it loads faster on the Lenovo Vibe K4 Note and just uh, let's just start the test. Now as you can see uh, for yourself that the video rendering and the 3D uh, test on the Lao 1S is actually smoother than the Lenovo Vibe K4 Note and in the Lenovo uh, you can see some frame lags and some frame scripts uh, but compared to that the Lao 1S is actually smoother and the video rendering is more smooth than the former. Now uh, while this video uh, I mean while the test continues in the background why don't we uh, take up the specifications of both the devices really quick so that you have in mind a side-by-side -side comparison of what you get on the hardware end. Lenovo Vibe K4 Note is powered by a MediaTek MT6753 octa-core processor clocked at 1.3 GHz and a Mali T720 MP3 GPU. The device has 3 GB of RAM and a 16 GB of internal storage which is expandable up to 128 GB using a micro SD card. Now talking about the display, it has a 5.5 inch HD display with a 401 PPI and a Corning Gorilla Glass 3 protection. The rear camera is 13 megapixel while the front facing shooter is 5 megapixel and to power that all up you have a battery of 3300 mAh which is non-removable. The La Eco La One S is powered by a MediaTek Helio X10 processor and is clocked at a 2.2 GHz octa-core processor with a PowerVR G6200 GPU. It has a 3 GB of RAM and a 32 GB of internal storage which is actually non-expandable and it has a 5.5 inch of HD display which is at 403 ppi with a rear camera of 13 megapixel and the front facing shooter of 5 megapixels and to power that all up you have a battery of 3000 milliampere. So the scores are in front of us and the La 1S score is around 56,848 which is approximately 18,000 more than the Lenovo Vibe K4 uh, gives at 38,285. The 3D CPU, UX and RAM, every score is better on the La 1S. So that was all from the N2 benchmark uh, for both the devices. Uh, let's go ahead and launch the Geekbench 3 and continue with the benchmarks on the app. Now, while the Geekbench uh, mark is being calculated, uh, I just wanted to inform you that we have already done a full gaming review for both the devices that is the La One S and the Lenovo Vibe K4 Note and you can click on the links that you see on the top right hand side uh, as a form of a card or you will also find the links of, these, of those videos in the video description for you to check out. So the Geekbench scores are in front of us and uh, again the La One S is a winner for both single core and multi core uh, and uh, as you can see the average of la one is, is also more and uh, for both and the Lenovo k4 and this time i'm actually not surprised because i had already seen the gaming things and stuffs so uh, let's now launch uh, the apps on both the devices and the first is the survey surfer and uh, i would bet on the la one s but let's see uh, who's the winner Okay, the loading starts, uh, okay, that's a close one. Okay, to, and uh, yes, the La One S loads the game faster than the Lenovo Vibe K4 Note. So uh, let's now go ahead and launch the second app. And uh, okay, that should be Twitter. And uh, okay, this time I saw that Lenovo Vibe K4 Note launches faster. And for the Facebook, I would give the point to the La One S. So moving ahead on the, to the next app and that is the YouTube and uh, 
again the lav1 is loads faster than the lenovo k4 note so the next is the asphalt nitro uh, okay the splash screen and the loading obviously started on the lav1 s and uh, guys you must be thinking that uh, why am i favoring the lav1 s and the, i mean the gaming reviews would tell the story if you check them out the play store again uh, this is a tie i mean both the apps loads the same time and now the camera okay uh, let me just go ahead and kill that one and uh, it was a mistake from my end so let me just go ahead and kill the camera and once again launch them okay and the camera loads faster on the lav 1s so uh, okay so the next app i'll use is the contacts and this time the lenovo vibe k4 notes loads and uh, i mean see the contacts and uh, those are different apps and the chrome also we'll just go ahead and launch few websites and the first one would be of course a uh, home page that is guidingtech.com so let me open up my bookmarks and uh, tap on them really quick okay so both of them are connected to the same wifi the act 100 mbps wifi and uh, the lav one is loads it faster but i'm not sure why that uh, particular uh, loading uh, it's not over yet okay so, but everything loads so let me just go ahead and open up the verge home page okay go okay things are loading faster on the lav1 lav1s when compared to the lenovo k4 note again now uh Let's go ahead and uh, run some of the applications uh, we have already uh, that are already in the memory. So let's start with the Geekbench, and both of them had the application running in the background. Uh, let's now go ahead and launch the Survey Surfer, the first game that we launched on both of them. And again, both the games were in the memory for both Lava One S and the Lenovo Vibe K4 Note. And third and the final one will be launching the asphalt nitro and see if that also is in the memory okay so uh, yes both of them uh, were in the memory but again the lenovo vibe k4 note took a bit of a time when compared to the lav one s in loading that particular app so friends that was the quick comparison for both the devices now i haven't reviewed the camera yet but from speed performance and gaming test i can certainly vouch for the lav one s uh, when compared to the lenovo vibe k4 note which is actually 1000 rupees cheaper than the k4 note price at 11999 plus you get an amazing build quality on the lav one s so which one uh, of them did you like more uh, do let me know in the comment section and of course don't forget to subscribe to our channel and do click on the subscribe button This was Ashi from Guiding Tech and I hope to see you in my next upcoming videos till then take care and have a wonderful day